Grace, are you cold? No. no. Elsa didn't make you cold? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she thought I meant like legitimately, yeah, are you I cold? I was so confused. I'm like, it's 82 <laughs> degrees out. I'm like, no. No. Um, I mean, it was a little chilly in there. It was almost as if it were. Let it go, Grace. No. So if you, <laughs> sorry, I can't, I can't stop. Um, so if you look out there at the Island um, out in front of us and all the equipment, Grace said something really intriguing, and she asked a question that I don't know the answer to. So if you're a construction worker, or a con or, or somebody who builds things, or maybe you're just good with the Google, tell us why those pipes are different on one end. Like the top, the right end is like treated almost, and yeah. then the, like the left hand end is like rusty. Yeah, I was thinking the rusty bit was because it was underwater, right? And erosion, and then there's a boat moving over there. Boats and stuff, look boat. Sup boat man? He's probably getting ready for fireworks. Yeah, but then I was thinking, cause then the treated part, like the color part was above water, because that would be what was showing? Or I was thinking maybe, I don't know what the pyrotechnics, like fire, if that would do something to the Right, if pipes. you shoot p fire yeah. out of the p pipe instead of like fireworks yeah. or water. Yeah. Or maybe if you shoot fireworks out of it, but that maybe. seems like, yeah. that seems like, <laughs> like that shouldn't be. Like, we're going to put this wa thing under the water and then shoot fire out of it. Like, that just doesn't seem like it would be very smart. I don't, I don't, you know what, Grace? I don't know either because I've never built a fireworks show. Yeah, me either. <laughs> As it turns out, I've done a lot of things in my life, but building a fireworks show is not one of them. Um, we have made our way over to China, um, and I am a little bit hungry, so we may stop and get some food. I don't know that we're going to get it here, but uh, we may stop and get a little snack, a little snacky snack, because um, I'm getting a little hungry. Uh, but look, there it is, the new fireworks show. Can you just imagine it with the fireworks and the... You know what I just thought of? What? It has to have some sort of like water screen. If they're gonna project yeah. images on it. Yeah. So it has to. Mist. But I mean, I guess it could be like a la um, Rivers of Light. Oh God, I hope they did not like look at Rivers of Light and think, we need to make another show just like this one I'm at think, Epcot though. I'm thinking it might be more like um, Fantasmic, like in our Hollywood Studios Fantasmic. Oh, like that kind of screen, that like yeah. water screen and like the, maybe the, yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe you're right. I just hope it's not patterned after Rivers of Light. I don't think so. I mean, I'm not hating on Rivers of Light, but it's terrible. <laughs> and they took out the performers. Yeah, they You know, did. I... Um, like I was all in with the performers because I love to appreciate like a good performance with a performer. But now it's just like, hey, we're going to shoot some water and um, there's n no performers involved, which <laughs> I don't like. But at any rate, enough hate on Rivers of Light. The soundtrack, though, is bomb at Rivers of Light. I do love some soundtrack from there. Anywho. I'm mumbling. Um, yeah, so new fireworks show. It's coming to Epcot soon. Soon and very soon. Grace, do you, do you know what we're looking at right now? Uh, water and trees. That is accurate. But did you know that they're like constructing a whole biggie thing back there? They're not constructing anything. Oh. But they, they have like cleared all of this land back behind these trees. Of, this is kind of where Africa is. So they like cleared this whole area so that they can prepare for the new show. Mm. So like instead of having it like on stage where everybody's seeing it out here in the lagoon, right. they like have all their equipment and jazz back here. And I think it'll be like a new staging area for whatever it is that they're gonna add to the show or like mm. put in the show. Okay. But, um, cause when I first saw the equipment of the, or like the clearing, I thought like, oh, Snippity snap, they're building a new pavilion. But then I was quickly um, um, shot informed, down. shot down, yes. Uh, that's, that's an, an, I was saying informed, which is a nice way to say it. Grace was like, <laughs> shot down. <laughs> um, that the new area back there that they're working on is in prep for them to move in and out whatever it is that they're gonna put in the new fireworks show. So it's like staging for the new show. So it's back there, I know you can't see it. So we're here in Germany. And there's their little menu here at the little beer stand. Um, look, it says beer, right? There. And um, so I don't think we're actually going to get beer. I think we're going to get pretzels. Jumbo pretzels. 
Maybe just one, because they're pretty jumbo. Um, anyway, there's their stuff. Okay, well, snack is acquired. Look, got to get that Instapic. Snap it. Um, anywho, so we stopped in Germany, as I said, and got like a gigantic pretzel. I have to be honest with you guys. This is the first time I've had one of these. Yeah, me too. Here, <gasps> yeah. Wow. And we got the mustard. Goldens. I wonder if that's um, German mustard. Probably not. Anywho, so we'll let you know how this lovely yummo pretzel tasted. Okay, so pretzel time. It's a big pretzel. The lich. Mmm, it's good. And I'm gonna put mustard on mine. I'm not into the mustard. I mean, mustard is fine in general. It's yellow. Mmm. It is yellow, even though the package says spicy brown mustard. Tell me why that is, fresh baked. It's good. It has that kick to it, but I like that with pretzels, so. Mm hmm. Like it's the really spicy good. kick? Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, I will say, it's, I don't know, noon ish. Not quite noon. This is not what I would call the most freshly baked pretzel. Yeah. I mean, it's good. Don't get me wrong, it's good, but it's not like fresh it, out the oven. Yeah, it's been, yeah. I mean, it's still soft. Yeah. But it's oh, not yeah. like. It's not like a hot pretzel. Mm -mm, mm -mm. No. Um. Would I eat it again? Yeah. Yes. For sure. And what I like about this is, like, if you look at it, let me let me um. <laughs> beauty vlogger. It still didn't focus. I'm not good at the beauty vlogging, clearly. Um but it doesn't have a lot of like visible salt on it, mm -hmm. but the dough is so salty that it's still, it's fine. And it's huge. Like, massive. That's why we're splitting it, because I ain't about to eat all that by myself. No. It's kind of like a turkey leg. It's, they're the same way, they're like so gigantic, yeah. you can't eat all that by yourself. <laughs> well, I can at least. Me and I can eat a lot of food, <laughs> but not a whole turkey leg. So, I would say it's a strong B plus snack. Yeah. My my only thing would be like you said, either get it earlier in the day or later in the evening when they they're making new batches. Yeah. Because they're just hanging out in the like the warm room, which is fun. They're warm, but yeah. they're not. They ain't fresh baked. Look, she's putting more in. But Grace made a good point. She's putting those in this back side. So the ones that were already there are now in the front. So they just get a little bit older. But all the same, they are bringing out fresh ones. Those are fresh baked. I mean, we did pretty decent, Grace. I mean, we didn't quite finish, but like pretty close, you know. We did, we did pretty decent. We did, we did decent. And you know, we did decent, the pretzel was decent. It's just like a celebration of decency. <laughs> I think we're going to go on over to um, Around the World Showcase. I don't actually know where we're going. Um, I know we're gonna stop in France and get a little construction update of the Skyliner and Ratatouille over there as well. So I don't know what we'll do between here and there. Who knows? Hey, Grace. Yes, David. I think I want to see the Voices of Liberty. You do? Yes. Have you seen them before? Um, no, it's something new I'm trying. Oh, okay. Just like the pretzel is new. Yeah. I think I'm going to try out Voices of Liberty too, because they're also new. Okay, yeah. You sure. know? So that's what I'm going to go with. Okay. I'm going to go with that guy almost ran into me. <laughs> he was like. <laughs> he was, he was really, he was watching this cute little baby that's up on the uh, little bridge there. Um, but anyway. <laughs> Sorry, I'm not distracted anymore. We're gonna go to America and see the Voices of Liberty. We're gonna start it with some fun, friendly Disney songs I think you're gonna recognize right away. Yeah, you've got a friend in 
so much for watching us here at Fresh Baked WDW. Go ahead and click right here to subscribe, and if you want to watch more, you can click either of these boxes over here. Thanks so much to these guys over here for their support, and you can find me on Instagram, you can find me on Twitter, you can find me on Facebook, and you can also find me there at Patreon. Until next time, you guys, Fresh Baked and stuff. See you real soon.